Hello everyone, welcome to One Fraser Do Videos and today it has been upgraded. I mean, um, I have tried to sort of upgrade my content by making a bit, um, it a bit more organizable. A bit more organizable, yes. So One Fraser Do Video. So from today in the video I've organized it a bit in a sense that obviously in the previous videos what we were doing were like vegetables and food and bits and pieces so i'm going to do one phrase of um, everyday words and phrases so what we'll be doing is everyday words and phrases so i will let you know that um, how to translate this but in the coming videos hopefully right so when in English, when we say yes, so yes is G in Urdu. So in the Urdu native language, we write it as this. Sorry, it has been years. I have been um, out of touch with Urdu writing. So if I do make a mistake, please comment and then you can write G yourself. Thank you. Right. So yes is called G. So how do you pronounce it? G. Now please um, can be used in different contexts. So we usually call it, it's a bit of a catchy and a slightly intense word, but I'll try to break it so that you can understand it. So it's Mehirbani. Mehirbani. So, Meher, M-E-H-E-R, and then it's B-A-N-I. So, please, is called Meherbani, M-E-H-E-R, B-A-N-I. Anyone who's good in phonics would actually understand this. So, yes, it's called G, and please, is called Meherbani. So, let's try to use them together. So, if I say... Yes, please. Again, it depends on the sort of sentence you are using and the content and the deep meaning inside that sentence. So I say yes, and then I say please. So when I when I actually say yes, please. So we will say G. Yeah, so G, some people will say D and G, J, E, E, and then please is Meherbani, M, E, H, E, R, B, A, N, I, or sometimes you can use the alternate word, and the alternate word is called Shukriya, S, H, U, K, R I Y A. So some of these words in Urdu might be very cohesive and very, very transparent and they might relate to other languages as well. Like in Arabic we say shukran. So in Urdu we say shukriya. I say shukran. So yeah, so when we use it together, it's going to be G Shukriya. Yes please is G Shukriya. Please is Shukriya. So Shukriya S H U K R I Y A. So what you can do is you can break those two words while pronunciation is happening, or it will be easy for you to pronounce them. Shukriya, like please. Yes, please. G Shukriya or Yes, please. G Meherbani. So we'll be learning some new phrases and um, let's tune into my next video. And I'm sorry uh, it has been a while because I make other videos on IT and singing, so I don't get enough chance to make language videos. 
but I thought it would be uh, interesting for kids and especially for someone who wants to learn foreign language in the spoken way rather than more of a gram grammatical way um, can relate to these videos and um, keep on practicing them again and again. So, yup, in the next video we'll be sharing the word no and no thank you. So this is yes thank you and that will be no thank you in the next one. Bye.